What's up everybody, Marcus here. In this tutorial you will learn how to make an amazing pump effect to make your video much better. And I'm going to use my own footage from a game in which I'm going to show it. So first I will play the video without it and then we will work together. So I put it, uh, the no copyright song in the background and I style it like in the moment when there is that ah and there is a shot. So first we need to find when the shot happened. So this is first. What we need to do now is to put mark on it. You will click here the blue, I don't know, button. Now be careful. If you have clicked on a video or audio before and you click on a mark, it will create a mark on the video and our audio. Also, if you clicked on just audio and you click mark, it will create there. So you need to always click away out of the video and audio to be here on this line, on the timer, I would say. So. Let's see, this is first. Let's find the second one. So this is second. Okay, let's mark it. Now let's go. That's the third. Okay, like this, let's put a mark. And now I will finish him in the doors. And let's put the mark here. Now let's go on a second clip. So one, two. So there will be one. Mark. Two. Okay, we got it. And the third one. And this will be finished. So there will be mark here. Now what we want to do, click on the first mark. Go to the video. And now on this part, we want to click this button right to animate the part. And when you click the bottom, it will turn on red. And now you want to go, for example, to 120. Yeah, okay, 123. It's completely up to you. Go forward. 3, 4, 5, 6, 6. And then go to 1. And now we'll go 6 back. And now let's go 6 now to the left side and let's go again to one so look what will happen did you see that the, the zoom in zoom out and this is going to be the most epic part you will love we are going to just copy it so we will click here you know like smooth line or you can just go right click and read time curve so, <clears throat> for example, I will do here a retime curve and you are seeing it here. Now we are going to click with our left mouse, just grab it, control C and let's go here. So we are going to control V here and we are going to move it a little bit. So let's see, but it's not right. So it needs to be a little bit, I think, further. Maybe. No, it needs to be far left. Wait a second. Okay, I need to close it a little bit. 
to see it. So it needs to be here, right directly under that. And I'm going to make this one a little bit zoom in here. Okay. Okay, and now let's go to this one. So again, we got it here. Right on the middle. Now I will make a much bigger zoom. Just you can play around it. This, this is the beauty of it. Like which one you like. Okay, and now the last one. So I will copy this and I will just put it under here, mark. Like I like this so much. Okay, and now look. We will make it. I will make a little bit here on the left to be and now this will be 210. Wait a second, I need to put it like here. I'm just repairing some stuff. Okay, now let's play the first clip. Okay. So the first one is done. Now we need to just copy the settings again on the second one, all right? So let's see. Okay, so this is first thing. Let's move it. All right, let's see. And the second thing, okay. And we can even I think we can put it even higher. So you can even zoom it if you want. This is like a really wonderful program and it was really hard to do that in a Sony Vegas in which was I working before. And now let's go to last one. Uh, by the way, guys, when I press Alt and Alt Control and I'm uh, moving with my mouse wheel, it, I will go further and back, closer and back. So zoom in, zoom out, just for your information. Okay, and let's move it out again like this. So let's play now how it looks like and if it needs some more improvement. So first one, for example, this, I need to make it bigger. I need to make it way bigger and I would even say way further. This was wonderful. I mean, this one was really wonderful. Great. And by the way, maybe you're asking, Marcus, how did you put the, the blur there? Because you could see, do you see the blur? There is this wonderful blue right there. Again, I'm going to show you, but on the beginning, let's say that I wanted to make blurry, like it's really great for a dancing video. It's really great for a video when you make dancing, when you are... Oh, when the animal is sketching, for example, for her prey, his prey. And you want to make the effect when he like bites. And that will be so great to make the pump effect there. So dancing, even swimming, action game. It's so many times, but you need to feel it from it. So for example, because I feel that it would be great to put pump effect here. Now I'm going to show you how to make the prism blur. So you just go to open a fix. Wait, I need to move my camera now so we can see. it. So now you will go to Prism Blur, 
to open a fix and you will find here in a resolve fx stylize prism blur you will just grab it and take it to your clip now then you will go to the upper right open fx and let's delete this one and we got this prism blur here now what we want to do so at this moment what will happen first we need to uh, turn our blend to 400 for example and now we need to okay blur strength i position all right strength okay we need size And now let's see, I mean, I don't know how this is going to look like, but it's going to be damn crazy. Now on the end, we want to go, go to the zero. So that's like how it looks normal. Then again, in the beginning, we want to make it also on the zero. So like whole other clip is going to be normal. Only those one part is going to be different. Now let's see. And did you see that? And I could, you could make it different for each other. And that's about it, guys. I hope it was beneficial. I hope it helped you. Um, if this video was helpful and you enjoyed it and you uh, used this for your own videos, I will be pretty happy if you subscribed and supported me because I really enjoy making tutorials and on DaVinci, on After Effects and also on Adobe Premiere. So thank you very much all and goodbye.